The head of Windows, Steven Sanofsky, has quit Microsoft just weeks after the launch of new operating system Windows 8. CEO Steve Ballmer thanked Sanofsky for his years at the company, but did not reveal the reasons for his abrupt departure. The news comes as a surprise, as Sanofsky had long been seen in some parts as a natural successor to Ballmer. Sanofsky became president of Microsoft's Windows division in July 2009 and turned the fortunes of the operating system around after the poorly received Windows Vista. Last month, Sanofsky spearheaded the launch of Windows 8, Microsoft's latest OS that was designed towards improving user experience of increasingly popular mobile devices such as tablets. There is speculation that Sanofsky's departure could be due to dissatisfaction with early Windows 8 sales and customer feedback or due to personality clashes amongst the Windows team. But in a statement released today, Sanofsky only had good things to say about the company. He said, It is impossible to count the blessings I have received over my years at Microsoft. I am humbled by the professionalism and generosity of everyone I have had the good fortune to work with at this awesome company. Julie Larson Green will take over all Windows software and hardware engineering whilst the company's chief financial marketing officer, Tammy Rella, will now add the business side of Windows to her responsibilities.